so I use uh, a tripod and extend properly. Um, the tripod comes all folded up, you need to extend the legs, so you can flip it out in the middle. Um, that will of course do even on its own, on a table or something. But if you need to get a bit more height, you can then decide to extend the legs. It's always best to extend each of the three legs the same amount, unless you want a deliberately angled shot. So that will give you a bit more height. But if you want it fully extended, you can use the other control to snap out all of the legs by the same amount. And then um, your tripod should sit at a reasonable height. Once that's done, you then have to decide how to get the head level. So to do that on this particular tripod, there's a little spirit level at the side, which uh, will restrict how you um, move the tripod up and down to tilt. But if you want it to be completely level, if you get the bubble in the middle and then tighten this control as much as you can, um, it should not move up and down anymore. It should stay level. Um, you'll then want to move the tripod from side to side. This is a fluid head tripod. So on this, there's a control here which if unscrewed a bit allows a nice free, easy um, tracking from side to side. If you tighten this a bit, it makes it a bit more difficult to move from side to side. So you get a slower shot. Um, but if you tighten it fully, it shouldn't move at all. Uh, the other thing you may then want to do is to increase the height of the tripod, possibly, uh, or move up and down. To do that, you have a control like this at the side. If this is unscrewed a bit, you can then move using this little control here, the tripod head up, and that gives you a good deal of height if you then tighten this screw again so that that doesn't move down anymore. Another way it can be extended a wee bit more is to unscrew this control a little bit, and then um, that should allow you a wee bit more height, but this does make the tripod a bit less stable because it's on a narrower base. But if that's screwed in there, it shouldn't come down at all. It should be nice and steady. So that's how to set up a tripod.